Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. currently outside of our house that we're building we are doing a walkthrough for our drywall so it's called like a pre-drywall walkthrough just to make sure that everything looks good and we're good to put the walls up which is crazy that we're even at this stage of it i think everyone's already inside we're like a few minutes late so i'm gonna go ahead and head in the only issue we have this little angel with us who fell asleep i think we're just gonna wake her up i feel like that's like the only way because we both want to be able to see the house here is half of it i can't show that part of it because it shows our address but here she is little angel this is where you're gonna grow up our front door it won't be this color i believe it'll be black oh my gosh darian this is gonna be your office and then this will have two french doors our dining room i'm so excited to have these windows in here i just like i'm picturing our table our garage where darian will be running his business look at our sunroom y'all this is crazy here we have the upstairs we're about to go up here all right this is our room oh my gosh Darian's closet. I don't know if you can really see. And then here's my closet. We will be using every inch. And this will be our shower. walk in and like see our walls up it was so crazy and just surreal that we're gonna be raising our kids there and just like hosting people and it was just so cool one of our guest bedrooms downstairs was like a little bit smaller than i thought it would be because i forgot that in the model home that we like built our house after the garage goes into a little bit of that guest bedroom so it looks bigger in the model home if that makes sense but other than that everything was like exactly what i thought it was gonna be and was so perfect and we have a much bigger loft than i thought we we're gonna have and also the sunroom looks a lot bigger whenever you're actually like walking in there it was amazing i am at sprouts right now i just got done getting my nails done how cool are these these might be one of my favorite nails that i've ever done i am about to go in and pick out some pumpkins and some fall stuff because we are having people over on sunday and i just want to have a little decorative moment a lot of my decor is in our attic and i need to get it out and set it up because it's a little over halfway through september and i count like october to be my fall month where i actually start to want to decorate and stuff but since we're having people over i really just want to have all my fall stuff together so let's go inside and see what they have okay immediately outside they have such cute pumpkins and they have mini ones over here Okay, this is kind of intimidating, but I'm just going to try to find, like, the coolest ones. I really like this one and this one, but I don't know if they're going to look cute beside each other. And I really like this. I would just have to clean it, obviously, to make it, like, a brighter white. But there's this one. I think I just like the fact that it's, like, flat. This one's also a good one. Okay, I like this, like, smaller pink one, but I don't know if I want it to be more orange. Yeah. I just made them topple everywhere. Not sure what to do about that. I need to get out of this area before I make any other ones topple. This is what we landed on, but I'm gonna pick out a few small ones. Okay, I love these white ones and these colorful ones. I'm gonna do this one. It's so perfect. And I think that's good because those are just gonna go outside. I'm not seeing a bunch of pumpkin flavored things. I'm gonna try the bakery. These look so good. They have pumpkin or cinnamon. I feel like I should do pumpkin. They have like a few random pumpkin things. This kind of looks good, but I don't know if that's good for like a hosting situation. I'm looking and I don't see any other pumpkin type things. So I'm gonna have to go somewhere else, but I'm gonna rush to get back to Darian because he's had back home all day because I've been running around. So I'm gonna go back home and we'll try to find stuff another day. My little angel. Are you a little crawling girl? She loves the phone. Look at you. <laughs> Come here. You are crawling. No one can be on their phone on the floor. Cause she's gonna wanna get it. She's moving so quick. 
I feel like we're about to have a lot on our hands because this is where they start to get busy and they always want to be like on the floor crawling. And her hair is getting so long. I just really feel like she's growing up so fast. You see the phone and then you went up here. Oh. Look at her trying to look. Okay, do you want to decorate for fall? Mommy got some pumpkins. Let's do that. First step is doing something with this hair because I am frightened. I do not have the energy or time to do anything with this, especially because I'm literally just about to get sweaty. So we're going to put it in a little claw clip. That will do. This is going to be the hard part. Getting things out of the attic. Is that what I want to do, B? I've been dreading this so much. This lighting is so awful, but just bear with me. I've never been up here by myself. Darian always does this. I can't even get it down. Hello? Okay. I got it. I'm so afraid. The problem with this is that we have so much stuff up here. Like, I don't even know if I'm going to be able to find our fall stuff. I don't know if this is right. Uh-oh. I'm scared. <laughs> Um, is this right? Is this supposed to be going down this far? I'm scared. This isn't right. I think it's supposed to go down even more. Whoever made these, we gotta do better. Okay, we're going up. I'm scared there's like snakes or something up here. Okay. Oh, it's right here. All right, I just handed Darian the box. Now we're getting down. That was a lot. I definitely would not have been able to do that if Darian did not help. We gotta put this thing back up. All right, we got what we needed. Now she needs to go back up. There was less up there than I thought. So it wasn't hard to find, thank God. Now, I don't even remember what I have in this box. It might not even be anything good. So let's find out. <laughs> That's all I can give. Sorry that lighting was so awful. I literally couldn't do anything about it. I barely had any water today. So before I start running around and like figuring out what I want to do, I need to take a little water. I'm going to drink a little hydration pack. It's like for electrolytes and whatnot. I'm going to do the lemon citrus one by Symbiotica. I love Symbiotica. They have a ton of different stuff. And I'm going to put it with a little spring water. I guess spring water is the best kind of water bottle that you can buy. Let's see if she'll let me do this with one hand. You guys should go research Symbiotica. It's not sponsored at all. I wish it were, but I just found them from listening to this podcast I always listen to. It's Life with Mariana. And she did an interview with the guy that owns, I guess, part of this company. And just the amount of knowledge and how they make this stuff is so amazing. I can link the podcast for you guys if you guys wanna listen to it. And Symbiotica, if you're watching this for whatever reason, sponsor me because I love your products. I'm hoping this revives me. I'm trying to remember what's what all is in it. I didn't see, wrote flavin. I don't know what half of this is. I just know that it's good. The bamboo leaf extract. Just lots of hydrating ingredients. And I just have had zero water today. This definitely needs like an ice cube or something. It's a lot better whenever it's cold, but they taste very good. All right, hopefully this revives me. Let's figure out what was in that box. All right, let's see what's in the box. We have a little crock pot situation. I think I'll put like candy or something in this. Unfortunately, I have a feeling that a lot of these are not gonna be my style anymore. Let's just keep looking. Okay, a lot of this is Thanksgiving stuff. So we have these like candles that I did last year that I really loved. And we just did like a ton of candles, filled blank space with white pumpkins. This is cute. I don't know where I would put this now. And we just have like Thanksgiving cups. We have a black pumpkin. I think this could be cute somewhere. Guys, I really think most of this is Thanksgiving stuff. Maybe I didn't have as much stuff as I thought. Oh, I forgot about this. It's crazy when I put this away, I was like eight months pregnant and now I have an eight month old. Crazy. I put Nespresso stuff in here. So I'm gonna do that. And I have this for when people come over, I can put like loaves or something on it. I'll use that. But a lot of this doesn't feel like my style anymore. I feel like I could put these somewhere. I don't know where I had these last year. I'll find somewhere to put these. But everything else is Thanksgiving, which I'll keep this in the garage because I'll reuse some of this for Thanksgiving this year. Our house will be like almost done by then, hopefully. Beckham needs to eat some dinner, so I'm gonna make her some avocado. And we're just gonna spend the rest of the night playing and I'm just gonna be present with her before bedtime. My next vlog i'm gonna be actually putting this out we'll do some fall shopping and i'm thinking about doing like a little weekend in our life so you guys subscribe if you have not i'm now posting every single thursday so i'll be back next thursday with another vlog thanks for watching and i love you guys